we have madam in red and chris in purple well i already have a favorite just because he was playing as purple but we start from the beginning we have in red madam playing as the persians this map is called fractal if you like pro games you probably already seen this one being played and well these are the persians for you the persians have the war elephant as their unique unit and now since the last update they also have the safar which if i'm not mistaken in indian actually just means to ride which is a little tidbit for you civilization bonus d they start with extra food and extra wood their tcs and docks have double hp and work much much faster as you go up in ages it is a great advantage a very very good eco uh, advantage as well because you not only make villagers faster you also advance in age faster and you research the tc tax faster partial tactics available in castle age i have no idea how good that is i don't think that ever um played a part in my games they can also build the Caravanserai in Imperial Age, which makes perfect sense considering they, they are the Persians. But still, not that great. Their team bonus is that it Nightline has extra attack against archers. Their unique decks are Commander N and Citadels. Those were the Persians for you. Yes, the Xbox is insane. Great video game, that is true. Oh, on the other side, playing either in purple is Chris 2. I think that's the way for me to never get his name wrong. And Chris 2 is playing as the Vikings. The Vikings have the Berserk and the Longboat as unique units. They have Wheelbarrow and Handcart for free. Warships cost less starting Feudal because, well, you can't make Warships before Feudal. They also get more discount as you age up. Their infantry are the chunkiest in the game as well. As a team bonus, they have cheaper docks. So, both players clearly know this map. Because one of the... Uh, just I just don't like this exactly. Yeah, this positioning right here is not, is not really something I, I, I like that much. Because the idea should be going here at at this point and from here you get access to the water and then you you well then you 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 start fishing and i just got information a voice in my head saying that lonzo is with us how are you doing mr wall let's go i'm finally in man i hate this game but i love it uh <laughs> at what time are you in I am 5.30 past a bit, 5.40 okay, right now. I will come fast, okay, this map is crazy by the way. Yeah, so uh, what they can do when they, they get through this, this wood line, they will be uh, able to, to go here, which is a lot of stuff in the back here. If you watched uh freaking andy against Hera. you know that he basically won because of this that's a good reserve you also get access to water but i mean it's it's much easier if you go this way right oh. but yeah anyway a tardy wall yes a tardy wall is still a wall actually, it's still going to protect you okay i'm at 10 minutes Ooh, 10 minutes 30 seconds okay so we are at seven right now we see, okay, we okay. see Madam pushing the, the the deer here, the, the zebra, which is very, very good. She's going with seven on, on the zebra. I don't like that very much, but well, it's food, right? Also funny that there is a zebra right here. She's hiding. The other I one is in plain sight. I think we the are... way to go is just like the behind wood line because the wood is 50 foot uh, wood all the trees are 50 not uh, 100 what do you mean 50 what the trees are 50 wood is regular is uh, 100 right oh, okay the, the the 
quantity of wood in each tree. Okay, I got it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah the red one. Yeah, yeah, it's it's much much easier to to go through through this than than normal. But yeah, the, the amount of villagers here on, on the zebra for for Chris is the the correct amount. If you have four, that's enough for you to grab all the food from the zebra without. Oh, 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 scout. Are we losing the scout? We are losing the scout. Yeah, the scout's dead. Without needing to, to make one trip more. Look at this. All four of them. Yeah, they are done. There you go. Both of them pushing deer at, at 900. Well, high 900s, but what do you think? I think it's <laughs> fine. If they can handle it, it it's always fine. Yeah, that's true. Uh, that's true. And did you see the, the low elo mining camp for, for Chris here? I, I love this. I love this. Kevin Kevin was the first one to realize. No, <laughs> I yeah, love you this. You can get all down soon. <laughs> uh, at yeah, what I, time I would, are you? I, I am 10.20, uh, 10.25 10 10 right now. Okay. I waited 11.30. Uh, I would okay. like... 11.30? Uh, yes. Okay, I'm going to... to to tell you when I get to 11.30. I would like this, this mining camp to be one tile forward because then you don't don't have this this much walking and yeah, you don't yeah. have bumping with just that amount even, of villagers. Even like two, three tiles forward. Yeah. So we have militia coming. So interesting that, that all the games that I cast as of right now from this mission cup, all of them had militia. And, and to be honest, in just these games that I watched, that I cast, they produced more militia than I did in my whole life. So that is very interesting. And he says, otherwise you got to rush the fields, could escape easier. Well, if they are here, I don't think it's that that's really uh, an issue, right? Because you just, you, you're on the other side of the gold. And one of the players is in chat right now, Madam Mage, how are you doing? We have the, the forward spearman which is good the opponent is persian so it could be going for for a a scout rush actually he he did scout the stables from from red red has scouts already so lonzo three militia two spearmen what do you say it is a lot for scouts to handle you will never get yep. a good fight with them Fair, that's at fair. At what minute are you at? You forgot. Oh that. my god, yes. Sorry, I, I totally forgot. Uh, 13 <laughs> and 30. <laughs> 13, 30, I'm coming. Yeah. <laughs> All right. We will we... I'm at we 13, see... 49. Yep, yep. That's good enough. That's good oh. enough. Let's, okay, go. let's go. So we have three scouts. Remember, Red lost the first scout. So, yep, there we go. There, there, Not there they go. Arms yet, though. Why? Just wait until many times. They will be much stronger. The reaction from Modern is not the there best. There we go. Though. They will lose one villager there. Oh, yep, we lost one here. We are already preparing oh, oh. To, to close this. Oh, 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 this fight. Yeah, look. The villagers can easily kill any of these guys, but you're going to, to either your, your eco for that, right? Yeah, but like, if red just turns right away and fight all of them, it's really the best she can do. Now, it's not the best. Oh, the scouts are but going to die to the spearman. Like, it was so good to get just mana times with extra HP with Vikings. That would be crazy. Just like, would finish the game. Where's the mana times upgrade? Yeah, but she, she closed she closed the, the, the guys in, in the gold, so they are protected right now. But, oh, the other scout just died. So, oh, let's look at this fight. Yeah, the villagers with Lund can easily kill this army. The only issue is you're going to need to micro them a lot. Because otherwise the opponent can just hit and, and run. And you're going to add... Oh, Spearman dead. You're going to add your whole eco. I'm there we go. We have the house walls there. Uh, what? Why what happened? Get arms? Yeah, he, he didn't. That's arms. true. It's not even being researched right now. He got horse <laughs> color instead of mana arms, man. Freaking horse uh, color. 
I love the, the comment kill here. Them. Just kill them. Like, imagine if, like, Vikings got more HP as well. Three mana times, two oh. spears with full HP. Oh, it's gone. Yeah, but look, she's still ahead in villagers and just got one one casualty here on the on the berries. Check. Oh, A lot the of corpse idle is time, but almost gone. Still like, purple could have just finished the game if he had oh, mana times. Oh, yeah, the, the three men at arms there would do a lot of damage. The difference between yeah, the militia and men at arms is so gigantic. So gigantic. Yeah. Anyways. The militia is oh. dead. The market is coming up. Yep. Yep, it is. The spearman is... Well, uh, the spearman is still going to, to struggle a bit, but... Uh, unless you get a scout for him. <laughs> unless you feed him a scout. What is the castle he, play here? Marshall Maniac, welcome, welcome to, to the chat. Elendo says it's a dish, not MAA. Oh, a drush, a drush. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah. I'm with, with Morley on this one. I, I find it very hard to go to go men at arms for uh sorry, uh, to go in drush for, for low elos. Uh like I said, oh 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 my god. A tower rush? Late tower it, rush, okay. It, it, it blocks a lot of resources, but... I don't know about it. Well, it is pressure. Uh, the, the main thing about tower rushes is the pressure. If you can make your opponent resign, if you can make it uh, make more mistakes than you, because honestly, I don't see Tower Rush is working without that. Then, then you can get a, a profit out of it. But otherwise, because the 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 kind of resources you are gathering for the towers, they don't work for basically anything else. There is what one or two unique decks that use use uh, stone. Then you have castles, and well, you are in feudal. If you had if you were in castle, you would just Make a castle instead of a tower, right? So, no. I'm, I'm towers are expensive, and if you tower, it means that you will not be able to put two TCs right away in castle. Exactly, exactly. But, but he blocked like a gold, kind of stun a bit, some berries, and he blocked four or five farms. Yep, it actually worth it. Yeah, the, the, the main issue to me is what you do with the villagers, because now he has two villagers forward, he, he needs to keep the pressure up. Otherwise, that tower is is really not paying for itself. Yeah, but this, this map is so close as well. You can just yes. send them back to one. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, from, from the test that I made, they are as close as you are on Haboob. So, yeah, very, very close. Knights coming in, and we see... Oh, we see Pikeman being Double researched berry. for... That's nice. I, for I, I like the commitment here. Like He, he already has not, three barracks. He is... Oh, three is too much. Yeah, the, the three is... Oh, that's too much. No, I take mm, all the things mm. I sent back, man. She just it's found so the villagers. Bad. She Why just found the villagers, and now they're dead. I'm on the Malaysian <laughs> Catholic. <laughs> That that was oh I, that was not a misclick. He's actually making militia. Oh, no, he's making huh. militia. He wants to go pike and freaking long sword. Just he could have just made two barracks, one uh, monastery, pikes, monk defense, some siege maybe to push. But that's a lot of commitment too. Yeah. B meanwhile, the difference what, uh, in villagers is keeps keeps going up because now we have four villagers difference. Oh, not anymore. <laughs> okay, uh, we had a four villager difference, but they are now both two on. They both are on two TCs right now, and yeah, they're they are both going for boomy. So the pikes are, are good at this point, but they they are not going to do any damage to the opponent, right? So what is the yeah. the end as game as here for the Vikings? Like you can um, just get a siege up. I'm pushed with Pike Siege. Like, the only problem here is this freaking man at arms. What yep. do they do that Pikes don't do? Nothing. Yep. 
Yeah, Fox pretty fair. Pretty fair. Killing mates, knights here, anyway. So, and they are cheaper. Instead of this many yeah. times, all the upgrades they could have like siege instead or monks. In they do have the extra chunkiness for being Viking, Vikingman. So, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Uh, Elendio, I don't like to make predictions for for cast games for sorry for games that are from racks because people can just go to the oh the <laughs> almost quick walling huh because people can just go to the to the server and look up the score right <laughs> then it it kind of looks loses the the purpose I, I want to, to grab your money. It Sorry? gives away the winner for the viewers. Exactly. Fight. I want I want your gold. I don't want you guys to to get that that much gold. Come on, that's not how it works. So the tower is still there. Oh, I think she can't see the 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 stone there. Yeah, she's attacking the house now. So eight pikes against nine knights. Ah. Uh, I like the, the the knight's chance here. Knights will win the oh, fight, maybe, wait. but not gonna not gonna trade Hello? well. Yeah, it's I just realized they, they also don't have they are not very healthy. Yeah, yeah, the knights are not. Oh, but this now we have the, the second. They will probably still win. The knight's gonna win this fight, but it's not gonna be efficient. Because really? Even runner. against the, the Viking Viking Pikes? I I think he would win the fight barely Oof. if he didn't move. Why? But why did he get the zebra? More pikes here, but still not gonna yeah. Not gonna win the fight, but it's, it's not a good fight. Like pikes are cheap. Yeah, Knights you can just make more. No? But once again, why kill the zebra? You, you are you are sixteen hundred Lonzo, why, why did he kill the zebra? Ooh. Problem is click. Ooh. Oh, yeah, the zebras are, are in danger, man. Oh, oh yeah, because she, she wants to oh, drop man. the castle. She wants to drop the castle there, so she, she needs to clean that up, but... Mm, she has to drop the castle because the fights are not the best is now the legendary. Yeah. But still, like, all the knights are going down for free. Oof. And, and we had a subscription from Bira, my friend. Meu amigo, muito obrigado pelo, pela inscrição aí. Não precisava, querido. Thank you very much for the inscription, for the subscription. And, well, I hope you have fun, our new legionnaire. Remember everything we gather from subs from bits and donations we are going to revert back to the prize pool of this tournament there you go we also have masty saying fractal i love this map no fish yeah no, no fish yet but purple at least has access to the water I, I don't know if he actually knows about it well he knows there's water but uh, not sure if he knows about the fish it's not worth it anymore. Like, if you're gonna go for the water, you have to go from early fiddle. Yeah, yeah, I agree. At, at this point, so, you cannot invest on that. This castle is almost exactly what I would like it to be. Because you are still being aggressive with the placement. You are denying the, the, the stone here. You can steal that stone. You, you can destroy that stable. So you're denying two production buildings from the, from the opponent. But you could easily have it even more forward and just destroy the DC, right? We have we have Siege or Chuck coming up. Do now it's about imp timing. <laughs> imp timing is gonna be important, but I don't know if Madame gonna ever find the right unit here. She's coming up with, with some monkers. I think she's going to, to go look for the oh for the relics for the old game. More elephants! Why are you making more elephants? No. Okay, look, I know the opponent is Vikings, I know he's going for pikes, but if you are Persians, you have a castle and you don't make an elephant, I have no respect for you. 
Uh, that's it. I need to win the game. Man. That's it. No, look. Elephant? That's what I have to say. Right? Elephants. There we go. So, she's going heavy on gold right now. And lo <laughs> what the Lawrence hell? Wall 28 can Chris it happy Fiendi to go to Galia fight barbarians. Yeah, go fight barbarians for me. Oh my god, what the hell was that, Lonzo? Meanwhile, while what? Lonzo is conscripting people Lonzo for the for his Chris own legion, Chris Two Fey is destroying the stables with the. Oh, look, the chunkers! The chunkers are coming! Do you know that movie? Oh, the chunkers are coming? I don't know. The, no, no, that 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 one movie that there's two midgets that try to destroy a a collar or, or something. It's called Lord of the the Colors, I, I guess. There is a moment when they are saved by the elephantos and they say, "The elephantos are coming." You don't know that 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 movie? cohort has a new legionary, Fire Seven. Oh my God! You, you gave so many. The, the, <laughs> you gave so many gift subs that the, the, the uh, text to speech is still talking about it. Holy crap. Holy crap. All right. So this is going down. I don't oh, think oh, the elephants are not gonna make it. Yeah. Look at the call. Look at the will call. It's over. Yeah, I think this one is is over indeed. Come on, man. The the problem was not the chunkers. The chunkers are are always the correct answer. It doesn't matter. Yeah, the thing the thing is, I think, Madame is either just likes to play the with units she likes or new to the game and doesn't know about the contest that much about the what the what uh maybe she doesn't know about the counter systems oh enough. the counters yeah yep yeah, I, I got or it or yeah, she yeah. just <laughs> wants to make elephants and just makes elephants yep yep i, I got which it which i respect which i which i respect of course yeah, I mean, like, like, um, Elendil just said, those are the style points. She she went for the style points, which in my book is always a victory. So we have the first one for Chris. First one was for Chris, and you can see on your right right now the different maps we have for today, and also these civilizations. The Romans have villagers that gather, build and repair 5% faster. The galley line and drum line has plus one plus one armor. Infantry receives double the effect from the blacksmith armor upgrades. Their scorpion uh, are also cheap as heck and do benefit from ballistics, although you do have to research it first. The team bonus is that the scorpion's light minimum rage is reduced to one. Yeah, maybe this time we're going to see some some fishing, right? I mean, you kind of you kind of are so close to it. We'll see we we'll see how it goes. On the other side, we do have uh you played with me, Alando, on this map. Remember? We were testing one of the, the scenarios. But yeah, anyway, we have Madame Plane as the Lithuanian as a civilization I like a lot. And well, these are the Lithuanians for you. So the Lithuanians have each town center providing 100 food, which means right at the start, you start with 100 food extra. Spearmen line and skirmisher move faster, which means the spearmen have a better time reaching the scouts and the skirmishers can easily run down the archer line. Each garrison relic gives plus one attack to knights and the leeches. The leeches are the unique unit of the Lithuanians, also known with the plural the leechii. They also have the winged hussar as unique unit, but they do share that with the poles, so eh, not that unique, I guess. That's why there is a an asterisk by its name. As a team bonus, their monastery work twenty percent faster. 
What about this matchup, Lonzo Wall? I think Chris is gonna fish, but he will not fight for the water and will go full Manhattan and armor. And well, if Madame is not walling, she will gonna have problems. Yeah, the, the main issue with the with the Romans here is is uh the fact that the map is very open. So well not for the Romans, but in their favor. Is that the, the map is, is quite open here, right? It, you can Is walk to the water though? here. You can walk to the water, but it's very long. It's very distant. So you're going to need to either house wall a lot or double palisade walled. Because otherwise they're just going to destroy it, right? They they have bonus against buildings. I will wall this easy. map so beautiful. Oh yeah, you, you have to. You, you have to. Master says he favored the Lithuanians, but anything could happen. If Romans get to the idea uh, the ideal comp, they are insane. Yeah, I love the the uh, Romans, the but like, I like the Lithuanians Ro too. Romans are good on water as well with that extra um, armor arrow. They get extra uh, arrow for their galleys, right? They get yeah with the unique tech. Yes, they get. Uh, Was that Romans? Yeah, the, the Romans get extra armor plus one plus one. An extra. Uh, unique tech in the galley in the, line yeah, yeah. yeah. that's the unique that's tech so we good. see we see we see madam going for the docks so it doesn't oh yeah just they as are, i said so are, chris is going they are both too late for the dogs by the way like madam is making a meal but she doesn't need a meal here what's the idea ideal uh villager count to go to water in hybrid maps mm, the one which is gonna take the boar, I think, like 13. Okay. Something like that, 13, 13 Fair enough. I think we do have two boars in this map, right? I, I need to check, but I, I think so. Yeah, they are taking the boar right now, so yeah, this is probably the second boar. Most likely. Most likely. Yeah, I should be at this point. Uh, they they so, both made mills, but like on hybrid made map, never go for a mill. That's a big mistake. Instead of that, yeah, like it, those three villagers can be on wood, then you can make fishing ships. So something that I see that happens a lot, okay, is that people don't realize when you click for a villager to to as you are going up and you are housed, you're only going to get worn once. So Madam is is housed right now, and if she actually actually doesn't realize she's housed. She's only going to, to find out when she arrives in, in Feudal and tries to make a villager. That's which well. might no, be a big she's, problem. She's, and and Chris, making, Chris making is out. in the same making situation out. right now. Chris is in the she same make, situation because... She, she's making a, a house though. Yep. He, he is too. So the, you need to, to always... They, are not, they don't uh, keep the freaking dog working now. Ooh, thank you very much, Zulu, for, for the following. Welcome to the Legion. We just converted another one. Yes. We got another one to come to the to the Legion. There we go. Uh, how how does it how's that, that guy says? I, I don't remember. Another like this. One. Yeah, there we go. Alright, we have Chris first in in feudal, but he did not went for the for the men at arms as we expected, which is kind of interesting, right? You, you should be already at your opponent at this point. He yeah, doesn't yeah. even have militias up, so that plan went away. But there's barracks. What is the barracks? There are. Um, uh, maybe he's going to go for for cavalry to just make spears to defend. Maybe. Yeah, that's exactly what he did, actually. <laughs> just as he said so, uh, the, the spear might just popped up here. <laughs> yeah, so, I yeah. This game. Yeah, 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 I think you do. I think you do. You don't get to, to 3k just by by chance, right? <laughs> <That's... laughs> Alright, we have a, a stables here. So, uh, a little bit about positioning when it comes to, to Age of Empires. 
this is kind of important it is recommended that you always have your productions building on the front of your civilization of your base and why is that uh Lonzo, if you could explain to our viewers why you should get your your productions building at the front side they are great as a part of a feature wall and then you will have more space inside your base to make farms and stuff there you go you also not in the case specific for for cavalry because they have mobility but you also have the the capacity to reach your opponent a yeah. bit earlier and sometimes so that phase, is all yeah, that like you need the military buildings always face hmm. the enemy should face the enemy i see a lot of people do it really like do real weird stables and archery ranges on the side but you should always face it to enemy yep yep i i do agree 100 percent uh greatest world and this is not time to to push tears but yeah so um elendo was the the red scout around here because i don't see it anymore i saw that he died i just don't see where <laughs> i don't see any corpse uh, it anywhere died. it died in front of the barracks from purple you oh in front of the barracks the oh yeah, yeah we can still see it oh my god yeah let's see that's sad that's sad right by perps barracks yeah yeah well, the weird thing is they both didn't fight for water yeah he they does have fight. a galley out but it's just kind of protecting his own oh this no. um I, madam you... this this is very bad the the rate at which the the fishing ship gather from shore fish is so slow you, you should you should it's very important to to pay attention to these guys they should be going for that's what i thought that's exactly what i thought you, you need to to scout this you do need to scout this uh why don't it's 980 for red and 977 for purple match doesn't work because this is a wreck also whenever you're fishing you should grab one of your fishing ships and look for deep fish because this this is a waste okay it seems to me that at this point if you are madam you should just stop production yeah and click up there you go i like his uh, i like her walls what do you think i, I like her walls does it protect the back of the the forest here the and left side is okay -ish, but the right side market yeah. is terrible yeah we we still need uh, yeah that, that should have that, gone all the way to the to the water right yeah yeah exactly it will grab a palace in here easy wall. then you can just protect your wood line to not get attacked by the range unit as well she got so unlucky now with the visibility from those fishing ships they almost found the the marlin that's right there they almost did it. Oh boy. Oh, they are still taking the This is this is Red's vision fine here. Tinha alguma coisa ali que te te interessava? Oh, okay, this might be a problem too. We have only 40 wood on on that pine tree. That's no pine. And those villagers are are ravaging it. They are destroying that no pine as soon as they are finished. There will be a hole, and you all know what to to oh, say when you find a hole. Land. What happened? What happened? Look at the TC from purple. Oh. Yeah, that's a strange TC. He couldn't make it next to the wood line because there's a... Yeah. Well, so he, he could the it. other one, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a bad one. Wait, uh, that? Uh, even that? up here <laughs> well he, he does have a tc up well he's getting a tc up so that's all that matters at this point it's a farm etc yeah exactly oh, <laughs> unfortunately that, that that became a farm to see <laughs> i realize that we always say negative things about the players so just go for the tc you want <laughs> i don't care let's go nah we we, we say we say we do say good stuff all the time. Come on. 
Maybe. For example, I love Maybe. that he got all these spearmen to talk to each other. They are now parting uh, experience with, with one another. The one that's wounded is saying how he actually killed two horses. The others are like, yeah, come on. You always lie, man. Come on. I don't believe you. You know how, how it goes? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they, they're, they're kind of like, yeah, they're guarding the relics. You need six of them to, to guard the relics. Why the fuck you lying? Why you With all that talk. Yep, and the monk is coming. The monk is coming, and one again, once again, we have men at arms. Oh, but the knights! Oh, the knights! The superior is not. Nah, they are not going to the do bear? anything here. <laughs> oh boy! But still, losing some superior is not that problem. Yeah, here, and, and and he actually got very very. He did very well with the with the. Spearman because he made the knights not realize the monkas were there. So he could easily lose 200 gold for nothing. And now, well, at least and now, now my is going for the other relic. The knights were, were guarding it. So now it's one relic each. Why purple and is not getting pikeman? The last game he didn't get mana types. Now he's not getting pikeman. Okay, Alendo, oh, Alendo, tell me. Great fight for red. Great fight What's for the, red. the point of, of this TC right now? I want to explain that to me. Oh, Knights I coming in. Oh, it's all piece. open. It's all open. Oh my god, the damage she can do right now. The damage she can do right now. Don't fight the spears. Come on, go find oh, villagers. The spears are still spears. Why? There's no pike, man? <laughs> <laughs> He's researching Bobby pikes, don't worry. Pikeman. Don't worry. After but she just found the woodline. She just found the woodline. Oh, she came back to fight this, this spear. No. We don't have the second armor, so these TCs are actually doing good damage against the against the knights. And well, she should find good good idle time at least. And all the spears died before being pikeman. A lot yeah, of Yeah, that's ago. very good. That's very good for red here. So how many relics? We have one each. Only one each? Yeah, it seems like it's only, only one each. But we have plenty of, of knights guarding the two relics remaining in the main, uh, main piece of land. If you have a transport ship, you can go grab the last one. Otherwise, I think they both know about it. Yeah, they both know about that last one. Oh, oh! He just saw oh the monka! He's dancing! Did you guys see the, those guys' moves? <laughs> oh that guy, that guy has drip. Come on. Okay, we have one final relic still remaining. Oh. And now the Lithuanians lose their fishing ships. Well done by, by the Romans here. Four pikemen is gonna just die randomly here. They'll kill one knight at least. Yeah, the knights are plus two attack right now because of the relics. They have forging and relics. And we have more fighting going on. Oh, a villager just died. A villager just died. That's good. Chris still has advantage in villagers, just be in workers, sorry, just because he has three TCs and oh, she's going to find lot, lots of damage. If she goes south, if she goes south, she, she's going to find lots of damage. Ooh, she did, she did. Oh, no. oh, no. She's going up. Still, still, she, she's making, she's making Chris work a lot here. She's going to find one kill. She, she found one kill, another one, and did we kill another one? Yep, yep, yep. Oh, now the pikes. This might be a problem. This might be a problem. If you, if you are going pikes against the knights, you should always go for the second uh, armor before you're going for for bonus damage because it's more important to survive because most of the the source of her damage. As a pikeman, is is the bonus damage. It doesn't matter the the base damage you have when you're fighting knights. So you need armor to survive the, the hits, and then you can dish more damage. 
So we have three relics for Madam. She can grab one more. And then those knights are going to be powerhouses. Because as of right now, those knights have plus four. And if she grabs four relics, they can get up to, pl to plus six. That would be amazing. I like that, that she, she she's going for a siege workshop. Remember, this is cracked ground, which means that siege workshop is going to take extra damage. Oh, Close oh the other relic wa was taken, it seems. Huh. I don't see the, the other relic. Where is it? Oh, no, no, it's 3 to 1. That's correct. The last one is, is in the Lady of Island to the, the southeast. All right, we have a ton of, of, of knights here. She's doing something very smart with the Malkas. That is healing your units. Most people don't do this. And yeah, she's she's it, it, this is uh, healing units is kind of um, an eco thingy you can do because those knights they cost stuff, they cost resources. And when they die, the resources are, are gone, right? So when you when you look at Age of Empires like this, like a battle of resources, it's a, a easier way to understand how battles change the outcome. Because oh, well, they are going so slowly because of the scorpion. Oh what, what? oh my god, look look at north of, of Red's base. Look at north. They are they are in, but Red no damage. Some of, some of the knights Ooh. back and some of the knights forward because she knows their army is not at home. So that's a good... And uh, she got damage. She got more is... kills. We have 40 Cs for purple, but... Oh, if, if we just get the second armor, she can destroy this. this. Oh, knights teleporting. That's D for you. That's D for... Uh, I don't know if she knows... She doesn't this know about that TC, Lando. She uh, doesn't know about doesn't, that. Doesn't even have legend, so. Oh, that's true. Yeah, uh, three seconds. He's going to get. Knights are still doing a lot of damage. And yeah, lots dying, of kills. Uh, right now, f fifteen to four in Echo KG. This is amazing. But at this point, Chris is still ahead in village. Well, not anymore. Now he's finally below in workers, not villagers. I think he is dead. He doesn't have a single army. Yep, yep. This this could be this could be easily the end. They're both going for cracked ground oh, TCs, uh, cra cracked nah. ground castles. If, if those red knights were going to laugh, they could can deny that castle. One. Oh, that's oh, true. Yeah. Coming. Uh, no, that's too late. That's too late. The, the castle is up. Yeah, yeah. The castle is up. So Red what I was saying about, about resources. With that castle. I agree. I agree. Drop the, that in front of the barracks and, and it's GG for sure. So what I'm saying about resources is army costs resources. You can look at, an, uh, at a knight and, and think of him like he was... Just some gold and food. So, as long as that knight denies more food and gold than you paid for him, then you are you are in an advantage against your opponent, right? So that when you heal like them, a I have no idea what you just said. So when you heal them, you <laughs> are making the <laughs> yeah. I couldn't hear it. You when you 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 heal the knights, you are making them able to to make more damage more resource damage against your opponent so healing your your units is so so good it's kind of underrated in this game to be honest one tc is down the pikes are coming but she doesn't even care yeah she doesn't need to care to be honest 30 knights Oof. oh my god oh my god yeah they are eating these tcs come on Come on, this is this is very close Why to to, to someone calling the, the GG here. Yeah, I do think it's a G to be honest. One TC is gone. Lots of villagers killed. If she folk, oh, the Canturion are coming though. The Canturion are going to to destroy those those scorpions. But the amount of of knights we have here, holy crap! Holy crap! Yep, yep. The villagers out. Oh, oh, she can. Oh. 
Oh, the bloodbath. Oh, the bloodbath here. Oh my god. Oh god. How many did this guy kill? 37 kills already. How many villagers? 21 villagers. Just this, this, these knights right here. 21. Holy crap. Oh my god. Yeah, he's going for... Uh, she's going for the... the 30C? The guy still has... Three, the guy loves his TCs, right? And yeah, the, the 30C going down. She's going to like... Okay, you can resign now. 105, come on. Purple what? gonna go that way. Purple going for the Doubt Castle on the front. Uh... My major fan prize has just crashed. No, I stopped the game. <laughs> oh my god. Thanks, D. Thanks for that. Thank you very much, Age of Empires. It happens. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's let's go back to this screen just for a second. Just pretending everything is okay. Oh, and now it doesn't want to start anymore only good streams have issues <laughs> i need to to kill the, the age of empires and there no, you go it's all fine it's see it's all fine no, nagra is here yeah i had to kill the process because it, do, it wasn't allowing me to to start the game at all steam has has that issue all right, so let's let's let's, kill this game. let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> Madam says, "Wait, it was just getting to the good part." Well, you mean the twenty-one villager kills was not good enough for you? Is that it? Because I was having fun with that bloodbath. Okay, just a little, a little bit more. Don't you worry. So, this is the third stream for the Summation Cup, and the second time I had an issue with streaming. So, yeah, Summation Cup, let's go. Alright, it's, it's opening now. You. It's about the game. Isn't that, isn't that the, the motto of a company? It's about the game. <laughs> oh yeah, it's EA, right? Yeah. Isn't it what what they say? It's about the game. <laughs> it's about the game. It's is it the not? Game. I think it's to the game. EA is for to the game. Yeah, something like that, right? Oh, yeah, the, I... uh, it's in the game. Something like that. So something like that, yes. <laughs> so let's do the following then. Um, to in order to, to okay, now, now it started. Yeah, okay. Uh, just just one second more then. All right, I'm back into the game. What, what is the the time we we were? Thirty nine. Thirty nine. Okay. When I upload this to to YouTube, I'm just going to cut this out, so no one will be the wiser. All right, thirty nine. We have lots of kills in the meantime. Yeah, that, that huge army. So so how would you stop that army, Lonzo? Would you get like 100 Monkas and convert everything? Because what's the, the other option? Another barracks and full pike instead of Eden Longswords. Yeah, I still I still don't understand. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Um, I, I think you guys can see it now. He should have never gone forward with the army as well. Oh, I did not see Chris saying that's that's a cool map. Yeah, it is a cool map. That's true. This is New England. And it was chosen as a home map for, for Madame Mage. So yeah, just, just saw it now. We have two total rhinos, which is kind of the expected. I was just unsure if that was the case. So you have lots of fish in this map you have the relics here you have lots of minerals in this little island too okay, would you would you grab a transport ship and just go there alonzo what would you do with that that island to the mm, to the east it's a late, late game team it's not that important in, like early in 
after after mid game, mid late. Ben immoral. Uh it, it's it's we are we are just fast going fast forward here just to to reach the 39. Then I'm going to change the the scene. So yeah, Ben Immortal, this is New England. One of the maps for the Summation Cup, the tournament. Ben Immortal is part is part of the what we call the Legatus bracket. These are the players that were a little bit above our our uh, maximum elo, and yeah, we decided to make one tournament just for them. So you said 39, not 29, right? Just to be sure. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Okay. We are almost there. So yeah, um, maybe one of the chances that Chris have right now is the fact that Madam almost found that North TC, but did not actually find it at all. The one to the to the to the far south as well. I don't know what was the point when when he made that TC, but it was like kind of here. Very soon. No, no, he, he got this TC first. The, the one to the to the west. Okay, we are very close. We are very close. Chris went TC crazy. Yeah, he, he got seven TCs total, I, I think, because he got three here, four, five, uh, and then he he got another one here. So six, not seven. It's it was six in total. We are almost there. Oh, now, now it's the bloodbath. I, I would love to see this again. Just follow these knights here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at them go. Look at them go. Oh, and they, they call their, their friends here. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. What is this? What is this? Look. Oh my god. Did you see I'll also go down so quickly because they already have the the plus five here. And as soon as this CC goes down, we are back to the normal speed. And there you go. Oh, this bloodbath what was so good to see. Look at the corpses on the ground. Oh look at this. This looks like a, a, a mass pyre or something. They they were going to be cremated. Oh my god, that, that went dark real fast. But yeah. Right now we have three TCs total for Chris after he lost well three TCs. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I agree. It's it's very satisfying. So yeah, like I said at this point, he already has five TCs. He has the those trees that, that were uh, in the middle here, then one to the south, another one to the to the west. And oh, he's dropping a castle though. He's dropping a, a, a castle forward. He, he could at the Zillow, he could easily swing this game though. Yeah, he was booming like crazy and he forgot about army. Look at the difference in, in, in working force right now 43 to 81. Holy, holy damn. We can still deny that. Oh, we don't see the castle. Oh my god. Lonzo, look at the visibility for Madam here. Oh my god. Yeah, that's like one tile, but even she sees that probably cannot stop that. It's when when that they problem, started constructing, though. of course she could. Look at the army. She has mobility. Oh, she found out about the North TC. Yeah, uh, that army is so far away right though. Yeah, imagine if she, she had moved them when they started building that. I think she maybe, could maybe, she could yeah, easily do it. Maybe. And now we're losing villagers here? What? What? What, what happened here? Oh, the, the main issue here I see is the fact that losing that monastery means losing plus three on your knights. But you said, well, you're attacking me? Okay. Let me destroy the rest of your base then. Yeah, the problem is purple got pikes versus knights. In yep. a uh, base trait, and pikes are not gonna kill fast enough. Uh, <laughs> yes. Nice. 
Nice, I'm just gonna kill everything. Jinska, how are you doing? Good to see you around here, man. Good to see you. W what time is it for you right now? Isn't it like very, very late? E okay, we, we see the. Do these guys have husbandry at all? Oh, it doesn't say there. I have no idea what's the base speed for the knights. But they seem to be moving so slowly. Oh, only 1030? Yeah, no. that's that's fine. They don't feel like it's their souls. I don't know. I think they got husbandry. It's fair, it's fair. It, it might be just my impression. They kind of feel sluggish for me. Hey, hey thanks Maybe for the gift sub, Lazo. Says Shamburger. No worries, Shamburger. Shamburger is one of our Legatus bracket players too. There we go. We have Benny Morto and Shamburger. Very soon they are going to face each other. And okay, so look, look, fine. He he's, he has a forward castle. He has three TCs again. All that stuff, but opponent is now in Imperial. 50% more villagers, better army. What do you do, Lonzo? I think, okay, uh, another castle, I think it's a good idea. <laughs> oh my god. And Caesar Augusta joined the Legion. So, funny thing, Caesar Augusta got a a um, sub before he got a follow. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm doing well. I hope you are too. We are looking at right now the second game of Group B. The first one was won by Chris 2FA. Vikings against Persians. And right now we are seeing Romans against the Lithuanians. So, can he I actually win this game? Like because... I don't think so, but what Madame does here is just... Like, don't uh, sit with like 42 cam next to a trap. Just go to their base and kill them. Easy. Yeah, they exactly. That's a good like, point. Uh, they are slow. Like, if nice, like, you can go. If there is something that you cannot fight, you can just go back. Yep. Yep. Good point. The castles go are going down, though. The first one. I think if these two castles go down, the, the knights decide to attack the, the base. I think it's G. There, there's no way to recover them. Oh, but attacking... Oh, attacking under two castles? So oh, I don't like it. As well. I don't like it at all. Just yeah. wait until the castle goes down. Okay, we got Cavaliers now. Cavaliers are 20% sturdier and attack 20% harder. Oh, did you guys see the teleports here? I'm not crazy, am I? No, I need to go back. I'm not. I'm not crazy. Did you guys not see that? Look at this guy. What? Oh, did you see that now? What happened? Pathy is bonkers right now. But teleporting? I mean, come on. Don't you know about the teleporting? No. Is it happening? It's not new it, at this point. It, it's. It's probably the the second or, or third time that i see it happening why why does it happen that's that's my question why uh, i don't know why but i don't know how it happens and when it happens when you are attacking something then <laughs> that unit gets garrison nah you, you are happens. you are wrong Lonzo. we just found out in chat they don't call her mage but uh, for no reason oh my that's, god that's how she does it <laughs> okay, so oh that monk just God. died for nothing. It happens, it nice, happens. Nice, nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that was a good one. And Andrea's we have Madam now following us. Thank you very much for the follow. And okay, the two castles are down. You have you have cavaliers under your TCs now. If she wins this fight. Uh, yeah, these guys have good armor though. They're going to die, but yeah, more are coming. If she wins this fight, then then what do you do? I mean, one or five, right? Come on. 
Yeah, this game was over for a while. And Elendil gifting the tier 1 sub to Madam Mage. Yeah, that was well deserved. Elendil now is the second in the gifts on our channel because Lonzo doesn't like to play. Lonzo came with his two feet up and said, No! I'm first place. My mother did not raise a second placer. I and am yeah. a competitive motherfucker, man. You, you, you damn are. You damn are. <laughs> and there you go. <laughs> oh, for human? That's even, that's even better. Love that dude. I love that dude. Okay, Madam is coming forward with the traps. And I, I, I mean, I, I love a dude that that is is persevering I, I i likes when when people fight until the end but i mean the end the end was was half an hour ago already can you can stop look, fighting already look at the villager count though he's got closer <laughs> yeah yeah he, he's very good in boomy he's now going up oh is that this is the empty C is going down just for the, the, the moral damage here, I think she, he should resign. Oh, he doesn't even realize yet that he yeah, says GG well played, and that was indeed a, a well mistake. played game. <laughs> and Landale with the, with the sheep. One more dollar to the, to the prize pool. Thank you very much, Landale, for that. And yeah, that's correct. Oh, this look is at GG. The third game. The what? Third Something happened. Are Magus and Hans? Oh boy! Oh boy! Yeah, this a is going to be amazing, stuff. right? Oh, but this is this is Nomad Hill. So Nomad Hill, Hans have the the nomadic horse, and let's see what we can find here. Okay, so the TC is going up right now for Madam. She's the first one to get a TC up. I like. Uh, if she if she starts she goes for this this shore fish here in the boar i like her position way more because chris is very exposed here he's very close to the minerals here but he's also very very exposed my cat is that trapped behind the tv i think i might need to to rescue him oh is she he, oh my god he just he almost toppled the tv yeah you would die if you did that yeah don't look at me like that I need oh, to look at it like this that. This is really bad, man. It is right. It's close to the to the Myros, but I don't like it. So exposed. There's so no so exposed. Not, it's next to nothing. Now. Yeah, I honestly don't like it at all. Yeah. But he is Hans. He doesn't have. He doesn't have to make houses, so he will have more wood to make it. So it's fine. Yeah, 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 fair, fair. The shorefish here is pretty far away though, like it's like 10 tiles or something from TC. Yeah, it, 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 oh yeah, there you go. We have the honey horse out and now he's going to gra to get a lot of score. I hope that doesn't, doesn't make uh, the opponent cower a bit because it is strange when you are playing and, and the opponent just gets a lot of score out of nowhere, but yeah. At this this stage in the game, getting getting some exploration out gives you a lot of of score. So this map is very very interesting because you have lots of wood in the outskirts. You can see this way it's it's kind of like African clearing, which is my my favorite nomad uh, nomad map. And. You have you have in the middle you have most of the resources right the, the minerals with gold and and stone you have the relic also in the middle you have lots of hunt which is kind of usual for nomad maps and yeah this is it I, I do prefer her her position I would like even more if it was kind of like here on this corner she would be very close to the shorefish and the wood. But still, at this point, it's it's much, much better either way. Master says it's technically not the worst DC ever. <laughs> that is true, that uh, is true. Of course, Master plays with Bloom on, like, and <laughs> Elendil, and of course it's not the worst. You will see some worst ones. 
Oh, you played with them today. What happened? Oh, we are house. I played with them today. I see a lot of stuff every day. You don't want to see that. Oh, she, she got house, but just for a few seconds. I don't think it's, it's that bad. Right. I will only say that don't go karambits on arena. Like, <laughs> it doesn't work. The greatest warlord conscripted Roman Empire. To the go greatest to warlord Tiberius. going for Vermin and Good Boy Eleven. Thank you very much. Greatest warlord. The greatest warlord's cohort has a new legionary, Good Boy Eleven. Good Boy Eleven. Congrats, Good Boy and Vermin. Uh, Elendo says. No shit, Lonzo? Why? <laughs> Why did he go Karambit then? Elendil, you shouldn't have gone Karambit in that game, man. That is true, stupid. that is true. That was a very good lure. Not not even kidding, that was a very good lure. It's just under to see these guys. The... Oh, no. Okay, you are talking about the red one, okay. Yeah. I thought you were Why? talking what about happened? the one because... Ooh, Just no. <laughs> no, that, that, no, 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 not that one. I, I don't I even want to like, look at that one. I was like, <laughs> so called being too nice to this. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is masterwork. This, uh, I don't want to talk about it. Do you have all the golds? Yeah, look at this. <laughs> yeah, when you have a, a, a honey horse, it's even easier, right? Where is the horse? It's here. Let's yeah. follow it. It it it, it seems to have I the swear, same visibility as a scout. If you if you play Afghan clearing with three guy, he gets hunts all the time and he gets like thirty sheep in feudal age. That guy <laughs> is crazy with the sheep man. He sounds like twenty ah. sheep in every game. So so now we have an explanation and I think that's quite logical. Uh do you know that the fact that the TC actually supports population right yeah, it, yeah, it yeah. is like a house in that that regard so it means mm -hmm. that some of these villagers actually live in the town center and they probably were the ones luring the boar and they said no 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 i don't want the tc to smell that that badly that's that's bad boar meat it, it smells badly well at least when you don't you barely know how to to cook it right so yeah i think i think oh. our french friend is, is correct here <laughs> but yes goat on the other hand goats are amazing i do have a goat here in in, in my house it's it's amazing it, it does a lot of stuff here and they smell very good oh the two goat kill here three no goat just smell two. terrible man say what you, you just need to, to bet you just need to bathe them. That's I all. remember it from my like kid days. The goat smell terrible, man. It doesn't smell good. You know what they 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 say about Turkish people and goats, right? You you, you gotta need to explain what you're saying, please, for the love of God. What? What are you talking about? Why? What you were doing with kids with, with goats when you're a kid? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man! Explain for the love of God! I need to. I need an explanation here. <laughs> Come on, please! Don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let, let's. Yeah, I'm, let's I'm keep this. A Muslim country, man, and they have this uh, thing that they. Uh, Kill the god and stuff. A uh, special day. Oh, I, I didn't know that. I knew where you yeah, live, yeah. but I did, did not know about the, the god stuff. So okay, she's Turkish going for. for example, no gods, no. She's going. Yeah. I, I prefer to to keep it in mystery. It would it would be funnier. But yeah, she's going <laughs> for the shorefish. But the walking distance, I don't know. What do you think? Do, do you know? Do you think if if is it worth it? I think it is worth it, yeah. It's free yeah? food. It's like sending yep, yep. villagers to uh, deer. Maybe that these ones fair. are making a lot of more trips, though. Look at that. They go. Oh, are, are we going to lose the horse, oh. though? 
Are we going to lose the horse? Remember, the horse actually can kill villagers in very specific circumstances, and the, the, oh, the horse is dead. The horse is dead. And El Elando says it's worth it, so it's probably not worth it. <laughs> not worth it. It's and Chris is sad because of the horse. Yeah, me too. Me too. So, Madam gets into Feudal first, but she is actually three villagers behind. Three villagers. Holy crap. Oh, uh, it's kind of two because Chris is yet to get Loom because, well, the opponent does not have a scout, so why should you care that early? But right now would be a good idea, Chris. Be a good idea. I don't think it was a strategic decision to not get Bloom. <laughs> you think he just forgot? Uh, I think he just forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, could be. <laughs> it could be. It could be. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see when, when he gets to, to, the, to Loom. You want her, her DC know, to smell like that yeah, horse? Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, what's your, your, your thing with, with, with smells, man? What's up with that? Stop talking about smelling, man. Every single comment from him to this point has been about dead animal smells. <laughs> towers would be nice. Yeah, towers would be nice. That's, that's true. That's true. So we have one scout out already and villagers... Oh, villagers got loom, so... I guess I guess he actually planned. That Chris was a bit unexpected. Chris, like all three games, he makes a lot of spears all the time. Yeah, he loves those spears, right? Well, uh, <laughs> it seems like like Madam lo loves her scouts, so I think he he's doing the right thing here. He doesn't even need yeah, to yeah. scout at this point. Yeah, yeah he doesn't see the on, stables. Like Table versus table war, the number of spears is gonna make a lot of difference. Oh, that's true. Thank you very much for the the follow deep strike. I, I like that nickname. I like it. <laughs> your your friend says I had a bad childhood too. <laughs> okay. <sure>. Okay. <laughs> Villagers now finish the berries. They are going for the farms now. Berritos are free food, so always good. Deep Strike says hi. And I say hello there. Now we're doing Deep Strike. How did you find us? Hello there. Okay, you mark it up. Made, you made Coming this up high for... so sexy, bro. Maybe he's he like just high. You made his high sound so sexy. Maybe he yeah, just say I... hi. No, but I don't know the guy. I need to make like, him stay. Hi. I need to, I need to be sexy. <laughs> Otherwise, why why he would stay? This is not a good quality stream. Come on, we need to to use our arms. Come on. Oh boy, oh boy. We have we <laughs> we have Madam's market going up. I I like both of their position right now. I honestly don't don't know who, who is ahead at this point because uh, she, she's getting a lot only... of scouting out. The only difference, I think, the way the red walls is just... Look at this tiny little base. It's so safe. On the other hand, Teal oh, is yeah. just... You, you like it, right? Yeah, wall. I would say... I would say yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's a good wall. It's a good wall. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I like it too. But, Teal will never be able to wall. But Teal is already up and he's going for stone. So, are we going to see another oh, boy, castle boy. drop? Master says he up. likes. Well, I wonder why you would like the the reds position right now, Masty. Could it be because of the choice in in Sif? Yeah, you're just you're just pretending. You, you like the eco? You're just pretending. I I know you. Also, Magus. Yes, exactly. <laughs> now now I know you're being truthful. Yeah, that's that's true. Thirty five villagers. It might be... Oh, we have a little bit of idle time here, Teal. Might a lot of idle time right now. Come on. Going for the upgrades. I think it's a little late no. on the wood upgrade. Why he's making a market now? You don't Ooh, make well, a market yeah. when you are in Castle Age. You make the market to get to the Castle Age. 
just opposite. But he did got the pikes and he likes his pikes, so. He got there four go. on food, bro. <laughs> yes. Tio needs to get <laughs> aggressive. Yes, Tio needs to get aggressive. Especially if he's not going for for archers. This amount of farms is... Nah. We need more. Much, much more. Meanwhile, we have a scout here just to... Yeah, this scout is the guy that needs to scream, right? He, he's not there to, to do damage. Nor to protect his village. He's just there to scream. When the opponent is here... And the opponent is poking at you, at your oh, horse. You scream to let everyone know. Three stables. Three stables. Oh. Nice megas. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's go. One TC aggressive now. That's the way I like to play this game. Three production buildings. One TC. That's my kind of play. Come on. Let's produce the knights. We have five coming out. Right away, five coming out. She did not stop on the villagers too, which is very good because that, Chris that's is delaying his castle. TC a lot. Yeah. Yes, it is. Can, can you not get it here? At the top? I think it needs to be at the next to the TC. Yeah, but, but can you... Protect his main base. Is this beautiful? The, the top of that, that hill? I don't, I don't think so, it, right? It wouldn't, it wouldn't be good anyway. Like, his base is so old. Oh, it would be so nice, a castle there. It would look so good on the screenshot. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Like, for Red, yes. But for Till, he, like, he needs to defend himself. Oh, yeah, yeah. Red you're talking lost. about winning the game. Yeah, yeah. Correct. Sorry. I thought we were still talking about the, the style points here. Oh, my God. Knights. <laughs> knights are here. We have five knights. We have the second armor. Very good. Very good. The armor is very important for these knights. We have Tarkans, though. The Tarkan is, is very speedy. But Tarkans he's not going to be good. fighting. Yeah, he's not Those going to be fighting fight. the knights with that, right? I hope not. Oh, Alendo says you can't no. build there. Okay, you can't. You can't. Fair enough. Uh, the problem with Madame is the second TC. If you are going three TC, three stables, you cannot put the second TC right away like this. Oh, yeah. And, and when you have lots of resources like this, the, the ideal is to choose one. You still have the boar though. The boar, yeah, good, 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 good idea. Hunt is always is always a good thing. Just don't lose that villager. Chris Ooh, is in the radiant. chat as well. Look, Wait, Chris are you kidding me? Him, bro. Are you kidding me? He, he is. <laughs> oh, I don't Ray. believe it. No. Oh, he, he can't he can't come back now. Oh, poor boy. He doesn't yeah, know I about it. Ray. Oh, if this guy comes back, Ray. if any trade card comes back, I'm going to trade give him rush. something. The, it is the first trade card rush in the history of the game. Is the trade card a Trojan horse? <laughs> Imagine a, a civilization that has a Nick Unic that is a trade card that explodes. It would be awesome. So we have more knights out. Come on, madam. Yeah, but you don't trade with the flaming camels, right? Can someone explain the, the trade cards? So, madam, when you. Uh, there is a point where you can use the trade cards to attack the villagers if they are idle for for long enough and it's it's very advanced stuff so you don't need to worry about this right now it's also a lie so maybe you don't need to carry about it like ever but yeah it's always good to know so the Tarkans, yeah look Tarkans do not win against knights but if you have like triple the numbers maybe with a castle behind could be could be Chris, Chris says it was him falling asleep and going for the wild trade card attack. <laughs> oh man, if if one of those trade cards came back, I would honestly give you something for that. That needs to be a bounty. I'm going to get the bounty up right now. Well, not right now, after this, this stream. Oh my god. This is so fun. This is so good. Come on. Okay, so... Madam now has 15 knights. Madam, please go forward. Grab these guys and just click inside his base <laughs> and just win the game. 
Because he's, he has no protection. That castle does nothing. Look. Look. You can just go around. <laughs> Do you see it? Yeah, you can see DTC. So, yeah. Easily. Okay, so those Tarkans are going to be attacked by the knights. And they're just going to drop like flies. One of them might change sides, though. He said, nope. I'm going to go with the winners. I'm, I'm good here. I'm good here. Oh yeah, Chris? I, I wanna see it. I, I Now I wanna see it. Let's see. Let's see it. <laughs> one angry poodle? I, I think you are incorrect, Masty, but okay. I think one is not enough. <clears throat> Alright, we have 13 knights against now 5. Tarkins, come oh, on, you don't fight knights with Tarkins. Oh, Red can win this fight. The parks are adding a lot of value though, but still. Yeah. Yeah, but but I see a little bit of anti-micro here. So a little tip for our friends when you're fighting against knights or any any unit that, that's mobile, avoid right clicking on an enemy unit. Because otherwise you see your, your pikes going for that one unit while they're being attacked by three, four knights. So it's 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 very bad for the fight. If you just leave them attacking, that's that's all good. Uh, I really want to see how, how the, the poodles, how big the poodles get in your in your town, Masty, because I don't think one is enough to kill a lion. Unless the poodle has loom, then in that case, yes, one is enough. So you see the, the Tarkins here? No, she doesn't. Oof. We are also housed. 24 military against 16. Yeah, she can easily go forward with these guys and just come back with these to kill those, those Tarkins. Because the Tarkin do doesn't have a good, a good attacking speed. And right now he's only attacking for plus 9. The knight is plus 12, so... Yeah. Go forward with some of them. Yeah, there, there you go. Yeah, good. Uh, beware, beware, beware attacking for... Uh, oh, good. Good lurry by, by Chris here. Did you see that? He's luring with the, with the Tarkins and attacking with the Pikes. Very smart. Look at the amount of bodies here. Ooh, look the bodies in the floor. I still feel like knights are just so strong if Madame fights. Oh, and she's also killing a lot of villagers. This was very smart. She she oh. she pretended to lose those knights for, for free. But no, she just exchanged it for what? 15 views? 15 views! Oh, 15 well. views! Holy crap, yep, yep. Chris recon uh, recognizing here. Yep. Yep, game recognizes game. That was amazing. <laughs> nice, nice indeed. And yeah, they, they are at 18 already. Holy crap, that was a very nice move. Now more views are going to die. The castle is there to protect them. But still, we have more than 50% advantage in villagers for Madam. And... Only, only a very good castle drop could do, could do, could reverse the situation here for Chris because army he's way, way back, way behind. He is always mixing something with pikes, even though he just needs pikes. Like these tokens yeah. are so useless. More teleporting knights? Yeah, she, she's, she's a mage. That's confirmed. So, Lozo, what would you do with 30 knights after you kill an enemy army? I think it's just GG. Yeah, I think it's GG too. But we have another castle coming up. And Chris says, come on. I paid for the, the full experience. I'm going to go all the way. Elendil says, I want to see, I want to see how mage does against a camel civilization. Yeah, it would, do, it would be something to see her going against Hindustanis, maybe. The Berbers. Yeah, because 
she she went scouting to knights in every single one of these games but remember this is just the first match of the tournament for group b we don't know what she's keep once again teleporting knights holy crap uh <laughs> okay i'm going to stop talking about it but that still impresses me how can you screw pathing that well but yeah this is just the first game we don't know what she's capable of maybe her next opponent is going to go camo and then be surprised by her her archers and then wow well, she's just going to laugh chris says i gotta go to work now guys yes thank you very much for being here chris cheers my man thank you very much well played chris. well played indeed And yeah, this this is mostly mostly what the uh, this this game right now is being about. Is the is the only position being defended by Chris? And yeah, he's still going for the for some kills here. Look, look how how long it takes for Tarkin to kill a villager. It takes so damn long. Look, they're going four Tarkins in one villager. Holy crap. Takes so long. But yeah, they, they are good in, in, in destroying buildings. What's their bonus against building? Ooh, yeah, stone defense 12. Good. Castle 10. Holy crap. Wall and gates 8 and building also 8. I think they nerfed the one. I think it was higher. Oh, really? I guess so. The villager difference yeah, is just insane. It is. It's almost double right now. Like, Madame if lost it, a lot, but still. Yeah, if you consider the fact that Chris has 13 idol right now, she has more than double his, his active, active villager count. And more villagers dying here to the north. Yeah, this, this is very good. This is very strategic. This is, is nice tactics by, by Madam here. She's not attacking just one side, she's attacking multiple points. But Chris, Chris is going forward to, to, to Imperial. He can easily trap down the, the one castle close by, but even still, his home is not being defended at all. Yeah. He is basically and another castle. Madam went to to the to the gold here, and she might call that Tarkin. Yep, there you go. Attack the Tarkin! Attack the Tarkin! He has five HP. Fight the Tarkin! <laughs> Come on! The TCs are so weak without flinching. And one went down, and all those village. Yeah, with the death uh, death of those villagers. I think this is this is looking like imp into GG, right? Exactly. 42 the villagers, main, 42. The main TC is not safe as well. Yep. Yeah, th those knights, 19 knights, they can just... Just go to the TC. Yeah, this is another thing that I hate about this this new version of AoE. They, they have priority to attack farms. I have no yeah, idea yeah, the reason for that. Yeah. I think she right clicked the DTC. So the pikes yeah. are going to do lots of damage. We have Mega. Oh, look at that. That army was so. Looking so good. It was like the, the Mega Hussa were, were leading the, the knights. And the TC is going down. Oh, okay, come on. 35 villagers. Oh my god. FM says feels like the imp investment was just too much. Yeah, I agree. He has nothing to do in imp. He got to imp, but for what? For one trap? Then what do you do later? What do you do now? Missed the first game, but nice comeback. And Bardock is here. Rejoice, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for the follow, my man. Hope you're having fun. We are at the very end, at the tail end of today's stream. And you should already think who we should raid you have someone in mind tell me in a few minutes because this game oof, it was a very nice game very good game the whole match was very nice to be honest 
but it's coming to a close. Lonzo, what, what do you say your first co-cast back? It's been a while, my friend. It's been a while. Too long, to it's be honest. It's been a while. It's been a while. It was fun. So much fun. I liked it. I hope you guys liked it, too. Yeah, you did not hear me saying this at the start, but people were, were close to rioting because uh, I didn't tell anyone about you, you co-casting. They said, well, what about Lonzo? Is Lonzo coming or not? Really? I said, Calm down. Oh, Calm down, Lonzo. Lonzo is coming. Lonzo is coming. Then they, they actually did come down for a bit. Not too much, but for a bit. So what we have tomorrow is a casting, which means it's not going to be live, of Mataya against Black in Black, and then Good Gal versus Murder Hobo, which is an amazing name. He only loses to Tig Beaties, I guess, probably. And Indus Pillow. Indus Pillow is also a great name. I love that name. Then the day after tomorrow, we have Life Painter versus Max Bosch. Painter is actually American. Uh, I, I said he was Canadian. I'm sorry about that. I'm, I'm sorry about that. About that. But yeah, he's American. And Arcas Max Bosch is. Argentinian, if I'm not mistaken. Then we have more live matches this Friday and Saturday, co-cast by Morley Games. So yeah, stay tuned. We are going to have holy crap! That's the <laughs> that's the fourth castle. That's the fourth freaking castle. Come on! Ah <laughs> oh, yeah, fourth is there. Oh my god. Oh my god! What the he hell is going on? What the hell is going on? Oh, Shamburger and, and FN actually know each other. Divion Furor is on the wizard. Oh, the wizard guy. The guy you, you, you told me about last stream. Yeah. We, we are going for, for Mr. Furor then. Because I like I like his name. He, he uses Latin. I like Latin. But before the end of the stream, we are going to have the raffle. Lonzo, I highly recommend you also say something in chat pretty soon so you can enter the raffle too. Let's go. All right. The traps are doing damage, but I mean, 42 army against 11? Eh. She just needs like three traps and the game's over. That's all. That's all you need. Wizard is AoE famous now. He, he's famous? Really? Oh, someone, someone, wait, 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 I actually know this guy, someone sent me a, a, a song about this guy. Madam, I now hope you lose all your games just because what you did to that Ibex. That was totally uncalled for. Totally uncalled for. Totally. Yeah, I, I'm going to need one minute of silence right now for the Ibex, please. Okay, that's enough. It's just like figurative speaking, but yeah, I landed. I did not know about about the the T ninety stuff, but someone told me about this this music that they made about him, and him hating Arabia. Maybe maybe that's the, the same guy. I hope. Yeah, so we don't have <laughs> we don't have a TC in the in the middle anymore for Chris, but look at the East. This guy is amazing. I love this guy already. <laughs> he said, well, let me reboom. We, we, we'll talk later. Let me reboom. He also has a market. Oh my God. I love this guy. Look at, look where is the market for, for Chris, man. Look at that. Oh my God. He's not quitting. He, he's, he doesn't quit. His mother did not raise a quitter. He's getting a barracks now. He wants more pikes. Three, five is not enough. Where's the other two? Where's the other two? Oh, inside the castle. Okay, they they are cleaning some toilets there. Okay, but we now have cavaliers. Thirty-one cavaliers. Oh my god! Come on, grab 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 a tur uh, a turret. Not not. Yeah, grab a turret. Doesn't even need to be a trebuchet. Grab a turret, atomic bomb, something, just destroy these castles. 
Don't don't let the guy reboom, please, for the love of God. <laughs> oh my God! I, I, what, what do you say? We we just fast forward a bit because this we game got, seems yeah, like yeah. it's it's a done deal, right? If this yeah, guy yeah. actually wins, oh my what? God! Yeah, I'm going. I'm going for times now. We have a trap coming out for for Madam Mage. Yeah, one two traps. Yeah, two traps is enough, but. If you have three, four, five traps, this is going to end in no time. She has more than double the, the amount of villagers. This is stupid. Ah, <laughs> the bikes are coming. <laughs> oh, that's funny. He said, GG, dude. He said, dude, no. What? What? Oh. He said, what? He said, dude. He said GG dude, well done. No! You don't say dude to mother. This guy is lost. There you go, yeah. GG dude, well done. One hour this guy is lost. and 22 seconds. Chris, you are that. You are that. Too. That was an amazing set. Congratulations, both of you. Well, especially for Madam, because, yeah, she won the game. She won. Two and yes. one, madam, coming from behind because game one was Chris all over. Well done, well done, madam mage. And yeah, the, the dude was was weird, right? It was dude, it was, yeah, GG, dude, well done. <laughs> 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 all right. <laughs> all jokes. Yeah, well, maybe he didn't realize it was, it was actually madam. Uh, and and he just thought, oh, yeah, maybe yeah. it's a Japanese name or something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>